my gardening friends in today's video I wanted to highlight a beautiful new daffodil that I tried this year for the first time and I am so mesmerized by it and I wanted to introduce this beautiful daffodil to you this one is called banana daiquiri and it's a little bit of a different type of a daffodil which I haven't seen before or grown before and it has this beautiful beautiful orchid like bloom this double color it has a very light creamy ivory yellow at the base and then it has this ruffled beautiful yellow bloom um, uh, in the center and the stamens are so beautiful it's such a gorgeous daffodil and i must say that it has we've had really really harsh weather in the last uh, 24 hours lots of cold lots of wind lots of now we're starting to get a bit of snow again so it's gone through some crazy weather but i just wanted to say that this daffodil is super pretty super huge i think the bloom must be at least four centimeters and it's really really pretty and it is really happy and not too tall it's probably about 14 inches tall or so but it is just absolutely stunning daffodil if you're looking to add something new to your daffodil collection i would certainly recommend this banana daiquiri daffodil that i tried for the first time and i am hoping it naturalizes and it comes back year after year that's what um, daffodils do and the other great thing about daffodils is that they are squirrel proof squirrels and rabbits generally leave them alone my squirrels may dig some up thinking that i have tulips but they haven't they have left these alone and they have been allowed to to come back this year and i love it i love them and uh, more and more i have been planting a lot of daffodils in my garden for that reason because they are so easy um, to plant in the fall with the squirrels not bothering with them and this daffodil in particular is absolutely gorgeous i if you can find this please do add it to your gardens if you love daffodils and want to try something different this is a gorgeous daffodil again its name is banana daiquiri and i am absolutely enjoying this daffodil in my garden it has come up with these giant beautiful blooms and it looks so good with the other daffodils that are fading in the back there and it is just a very very stunning daffodil and I just wanted to highlight this plant today because I think it's gorgeous and um, it wasn't super early to bloom so it's just started blooming in this last week so I would say it's a mid, mid spring bloomer and um, for us it's still early spring so but it is later than the other daffodils like the tete -a tete and the other daffodils that I have blooming here so just wanted to show this beautiful daffodil to you today and I hope this has brightened your day it's suddenly really cold for us here today and I wanted to just come out here and um, this daffodil has cheered me up so much it's blooming and it's nodding and it's looking beautiful in this front garden here and I wanted to highlight this daffodil I love this sea of yellow that's in my front yard right now and I'm just mesmerized by these daffodils thank you so much for joining me today and thank you for all the new subscribers who have joined my channel recently I am so very happy to have you on my channel and I hope you will follow me along this season and see what else is blooming in my garden and I am super excited lots of things are starting to come up and this is one of them and I hope you enjoyed this video please do find this in your garden centers in the fall and add it um, add it to your gardens it's just gorgeous thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you in my next video